See, they save money on a dump guy. They save yeah. money oh, on yeah. lawyer fees. That's what it is. Very safe radio. If a signal goes out, but there isn't a radio on <laughs> to to <laughs> translate that signal into actual sound, yeah. are you really doing a show? I was No, they probably have a dump guy, because what happens if a vegetarian calls up and she's sticking her nose in someone's business. <laughs> <That's> right. <laughs> right on. Andrew, New York, you're on the Opie and Anthony show. Yeah, John and Jeff, with two guys, I should make two guys one cup. <laughs> <laughs> Not, nice. They do. It's called their show. <laughs> <laughs> and the listener has to eat it. <laughs> Uh, we got Jim Jeffries standing by, so we're going to have to take a break. Yes, young yes. Jim is here. I didn't even know he was in town. Yeah, but we're very excited. None of us knew. He killed on your uh, down and dirty Yeah, he did. Show. Jim was, was, was loved. Uh, did we play uh, John and Jeff? There's two of them? No, I don't think we did. Oh, okay. <laughs> the John and, the John Jeff, John and Jeff, Jeff Show. We're two guys who think there is no excuse for poor neighborhoods being dirty. We're two guys who think any band that comes back after a farewell tour should be sued. We're two guys who think parole boards should be eliminated. We're two guys who think children's beauty pageants are comfort food for perverts. The John and the Jeff, Jeff, Jeff Show. The John and Jeff Show. John? <laughs> <laughs> They love their comfort food. Yes, he loves his com <laughs> Thailand comfort food, doesn't oh my he? God. Uh, let me say hi to Mark in Florida. Mark, how are you, buddy? What's up, guys? Hey. Hey, there, there was nothing on late night radio, and I used to have to listen to these clowns. They went on for an hour on a bit that they went to a party one night, and I don't know which clown it was, but he went in and made number two in the bathroom and streaked and was too embarrassed to leave and spend an hour on how he got out of the bathroom by first trying toilet paper, and then he ended up using the guy's toothpaste, and then finally his toothbrush, and then he left. That's that a liar. Right, from excitement. A, that's all lies. It's a lie. He <laughs> do that. He didn't. Oh, that was their hour-long bit. That was how they filled time. Did he talk about how he broke his tampon applicator? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It never probably. happened. It just never happened. That's embarrassing. <laughs> I'm sure it didn't, but that was just one of their bits. If, if you really care, just a, a little bit of toilet paper takes care of that, and you're, you're out of there in a minute. John or you just and, leave it for someone else to enjoy. John and Jeff, we're two guys the store. <laughs> <laughs> These guys are awful. Horrendous. Uh, John and Jeff talk about getting an A for effort. This is the last track before we take a break and get uh, Jim Jeffries in here, and then maybe we'll do a little more. Yes, of this two guys humor for everybody. Oh, yeah, it's great stuff. Yeah, but, it, uh, I give you, I, bo I give you both an A for effort, but an F because you didn't get the answer. I mean, think about oh. that. You know, when the teacher would always say, "I give you an A for effort, but I give you a a C on the project." I mean, that really. Yeah, but wasn't that letter? <laughs> ugh, didn't that letter mean something other than fail? A C sure did to you, uh, I bet. Yeah, think about that. No why? <laughs> why use vulgar language? Hey, exactly. On uh, yeah. on homework assignments. I mean, think F. About it. <laughs> right. It's like, wait a minute. Right. Show me some respect. Why would you? Why would you say that to me? Yeah, exactly. All I, I, you know, all right. I got to study harder, but don't insult me. Oh my God! I'm, I, I, it just makes you look at me. Look, I need that blood pressure machine. <laughs> the blood Can I tell you pressure. something about radio? <laughs> when people meet me out and about, they go, "Wow, your voice is different uh, in real life." This thing right here makes yeah. everyone sound like they got balls. <laughs> yeah. You hear his voice through all that processing? <laughs> <laughs> what does he sound like in real life if, 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 if this equipment can't pump him up a bit and make him more bassy? Spuds Buckley? Wow. <laughs> yeah, but I was also like, you know. A little tater. I was like, yes, a little tater tot. We're two guys who believe, ah, 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 fudgy. <laughs> Wudgy. Bar. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bear man. Why are you making this about me? I don't know. I gotta get, I gotta get at you somehow. This is this is about John and Jeff today. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was just starting out. These guys have been doing it for a while. <laughs> so what? What do they? Uh, what do they say uh, there? God. An A for effort. Yeah. yeah. Is that worth the whole break? Can you imagine us doing a whole break on you know? I, you know how they used to give you an A for effort? But then they. What does that mean? They twisted it because it's like F means failure but f means a bad word too so it's like yeah. why would you say that to me yeah Ooh. why do they give an a for effort yeah. uh, it's good stuff observational humor it's great yeah when i was in school i don't know what it meant but they would i would get an a a b or a cs 
or uh, <laughs> D. <laughs> All right, well, thank God this October is almost over. It's exhausting. <laughs> it's exhausting. <laughs> it's exhausting. Jack Vember. No. <laughs> Poe Vember. We all know. Ah. Uh, you want to do more John and Jeff stuff or what? As long as we don't poke fun. Well, uh, <laughs> let's not be mean spirited. These guys are good. Well, maybe we could get uh, you know Jeffrey's angle on this. Uh, for the whole month of October, we're just featuring horrendous radio. Right. It's called Jocktober, you know. And we got this uh, show. They they're John and Jeff. They do overnights, and they're just horrendous. I, I'm sure you've done a, a lot of bad radio shows in your day. Huh? I I have been on them and, and done them and <laughs> and yes, been part, part of, of them. them. Yeah. <laughs> oh my word. Yeah. Well, we get back into this with John and Jeff. They ask their trivia question. Every morning show needs a trivia question. Of course. Sam, why don't we have a trivia question? That's I don't different. know. I mean, if you care about the callers, you want to get them involved a little bit, you got to have a trivia question so we can call up and win some fun stuff. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Sarcastic ass. And in an effort to fill time, they repeat and rephrase it for 60 seconds. Yes, this is a minute. Of the question being asked over and over again. Why? But it's kind of a complicated question. Did it have to fit into the music bed they were using? I think they just have a lot of time to fill overnight. All right, here we go. <laughs> overnight. The John and Jeff trivia question. So here is the steers <laughs> doing overnight. Go on, sort it out. Some people take yeah, them. Not <laughs> 10 years. You know. Some people make the morning commute earlier. <laughs> That's their uh, the little slug line. Yeah. yeah. They're yeah. very popular with bikers. So here is the student <laughs> uses trivia question. On the line, two party passes to our third shift, 10th anniversary party. Here's oh the question. Ten years. 50% of these items purchased are returned for exchange or refund. Tie hookers. Jeff, could you yes. please Condoms. repeat that question? <laughs> All right. <laughs> and then he says, could you repeat that question? Repeat it? For Just what like reason? A, you didn't get it. It was very complicated. Are returned for exchange or refund? Jeff, could you please repeat that question, please? All right. 50% of these items purchased are returned for exchange or refund. What item? Adult diapers. What is it? <laughs> Hang on. I think we've got one more repeat. You think? I yeah, think we might. Or maybe even two. One what more. is it? People buy these and then 50% <laughs> of them are returned for uh, <laughs> refund or <Slaves>. exchange. <laughs> hmm, let me think about this. Yeah. I'm going to go your Half soul. The people return these for a <laughs> refund or an exchange. Yeah, uh, what do you John think it is? John and Jeff stickers. <laughs> like the 50% of these items per <laughs> Oh, my God, they're still doing it. Of course they are. 50%. Half? These are John and Jeff party tickets on the line. we got to make sure the question is... <laughs> they have a party. The yes. party actually goes from 6 in the morning to 10 in the morning because they're busy at night. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a nighttime party. Oh it's a lunch. They're going for a fifth repeat of that dumb question? I make... thought three would be a lot. No, the people have to know the question. Hmm. What is the question? 50% of these items purchased are returned for exchange or refund. Don't, don't do it for a sixth time. Please don't. <clears throat> it's got to be Oof. a fruitcake. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Actually, that's as good an answer oh. as any fruitcake. Yeah, that's... That's what he leaves on Thai girl's back. <laughs> Fruit cake. <laughs> or, or boys. <laughs> or fruity young boys. Yeah, yeah whatever. <laughs> we don't get the answer, do we? No. Oh, good. They will, they will <laughs> never know. No. I have to have the answer. Now. I would no, like to I know what 50% of people... All right, well, Sam, Sam knows how to do this bit. Next track is Michael calls in and tries to answer the question, displaying the utter excitement this bit brings. <laughs> right, because if he gets it right... You gotta believe that it's gonna be somebody jumping for joy. Yeah. If he gets it wrong, it's just gonna be someone crushed. Because oh. of the t tickets that are on the line. Yeah, just the raw emotion in this guy's voice. All right. All right, let's go to Michael. You're next on the John and Jeff show. Hello, Mike. Yes, I'm here. Um, good morning to you guys. Good morning. Good morning to you, sir. Um, in reference to, uh, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna take a guess at your uh, question. I'm thinking it's neckties, but I don't know. But that's neither here nor there. All right, hold on. Okay. Is, is that your final answer? That's the only answer. So you think 50% of neckties are returned for exchange or refund? <laughs> I just made a wild guess. Okay, wild <laughs> guess. Let's see if that wild guess pays off. That is not uh, the answer I have. Oh. 
Oh, oh, oh. wow. Uh, he was almost wearing his Colombian neckties. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>